Ciao ragazzi, so this is the video about the best Scottish presents or souvenirs that I recommend you to buy. And this is my choice, okay? So that's a disclaimer. That's my personal idea, okay? Of what really the great presents from Scotland are. Okay, so the first thing is the tartan scarf. And this is actually the one that I bought for myself recently. And first of all, they are all unique with a unique pattern, which is called tartan. And it's only in Scotland that you can find such variety. And this is... This the one actually is from Lambool, so you can also find cashmere. They're a bit more expensive, but the Lambool is the most popular one. And there are lots of souvenir shops with thousands of them, thousands of tartans. And please don't be lazy to check what your what your tartan means, yes, and which clan it refers to. So there can be some really interesting ideas. You can find something more red, more blue. This one is actually multicolorful, and I really like it. So the second thing I would say is a bit about treats, and this is the fudge. The tablet, the Scottish tablet, Scottish fudge is one of the really nice coffee, eh, not coffee, sorry, caramel toffee thing. And it's really nice uh, with coffee or tea. So, and then the second one is, of course, eh, the third one, sorry, I'm bad at calculating. And that's shortbread. And I would say that um, you can find the, the typical one, the classical one, with a bit of chocolate chip as well. And there is also, if I'm not mistaken, uh, the caramel one shortbread. So that's all butter one, the classical. And it's incredible. You'll never overeat it because it's quite the, uh, too hard enough, you know. Great with tea and coffee as well. And then, of course, it goes without saying that tea must be present in any, let's say, UK present, okay? So this one I bought in the Hollywood House Palace that we have here. And um, so that's the typical Scottish breakfast, uh, Scottish, sorry, English breakfast. <laughs> you see, I'm already all, <laughs> Scottish England, all the same for me. So, and yeah, English breakfast, they also have um, Earl Grey, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so you can find lots of different uh, types of teas and um, also di different um, it depends on the shop, for, of course, yes, but in the palace, you can find only the palace tea, so the royal tea, but up to you, yes, you can find any other ones. And yeah, this is my personal choice here, so that's why uh, it will be some dual, okay? So I would say that uh, Scotland and Ireland, they are all popular in some Celtic, you know, um, symbols, so that's why something like you know, these, like a ring I bought with a thistle, I hope you see, okay, and that silver one, and there are lots of Celtic, you know, other different designs that you can find, and I also bought, again for myself, you know, like, it's never enough, right? <laughs> you understand me, girls, I hope, <laughs> right? I bought also the earrings, but you can find the brooches, you can find, you know, lots of, lots of things in the castles, in tourist um, traps, shops, and so on. So these ones, have a look. Okay, so they've got also this uh, uh, nice symbol, the Celtic symbol. It's called, now sorry for my pronunciation, Triquetra. Triquetra now, you know, with the Italian accent already. Um, so it's like earth, land, let me uh, cheat. Earth, have an, oh no dear, there are three variants, okay, two variants, sorry. So it is earth, sea and sky, and there's spiritual worlds as well. So it will be uh, earth, heaven and underworld, right? Okay, so it's all there. So these are the silver earrings as well. You will find lots of things, yes, and they're quite unique in Scotland and Ireland, but we're talking about Scotland as only. So here are my personal um recommendations and uh, no matter what you buy yes no matter what you do i'm not talking about typical magnets you know and keychains that everyone buys and uh, just enjoy the country